Estelle Harris, born on April 22, 1928 in Manhattan, New York. She was an American actress known for her exaggerated shrill, grating voice. She was best known for her role as George's mother Estelle Costanza on Seinfeld. Her other roles included the voice of Mrs. Potato Head in the Toy Story franchise, Muriel in The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, and Mamagunda in Tarzan 2. Estelle Nussbaum was born in the Hell's Kitchen neighborhood of Manhattan. She moved to Tarentum, Pennsylvania, when she was seven years old to live near her aunt and uncle, who asked her father to work in their candy store. She graduated from Tarentum High School. After her children grew up, Harris pursued acting and achieved early success in television commercials, even logging 23 spots in a year at one point. One of her most famous commercials had her energetically singing the praises of Handy Rap 2. In 1977, Harris began her long-format acting career in the film looking up about three generations of a working-class Jewish family in New York City. She became widely known for her supporting role as Estelle Costanza on Seinfeld. In Star Trek, Voyager, she portrayed the old woman who was actually a projection of the Nichani spirits, in the third season Voyager episode, Sacred Ground, which aired on October 20, 1996. She played a small role as Bridget in Out to Sea. In Toy Story 2 she provided the voice of Mrs. Potato Head and would continue to reprise the role for the franchise. In 2005, she lent her voice to Mamagunda in Tarzan 2. In The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, Harris had a recurring role as Muriel. In 2007, she appeared in Brad Paisley's music video for the song, Online. Harris reprised her role of Mrs. Potato Head in Toy Story 3. In 1952, Harris met window treatment salesman C. Harris at a dance. Six months later, they were married. She had two sons and a daughter. Harris also had three grandsons and one great-grandson. Once her children started school, Harris pursued acting roles, first in amateur productions, then dinner theatre and commercials. On September 20, 2001, the couple's car blew a tire and flipped twice, but they managed to escape serious injuries. Her husband C died on January 11, 2021. On April 2, 2022, Harris died of natural causes at her home in Palm Desert, California, at the age of 93.